What's up guys, Jordan here from Show Me Vegas and I'm standing outside one of Las Vegas' newest attractions, it's Atomic Golf. You've probably heard of Top Golf, but have you heard of Atomic Golf? Let's go check this place out and see what it's all about. All right, so I got here to Atomic Golf and I got checked in. First things first, where is Atomic Golf? You're gonna find it at the extreme north end of the Strip, right next to the Strat. As a matter of fact, there's a hallway from the Strat Casino all the way to the edge of the parking lot here at Atomic Golf, so you can walk right out of the Strat, right across the parking lot, and be here safely. Secondly, what exactly is it? Well, it's an interactive driving range. It's a great group activity. You know what, rather than just tell you, why don't I just show you? That one's pretty decent. Simply put, Atomic Golf is a driving range on steroids, featuring 103 hitting bays spread across four levels and 99,000 square feet of space. The venue features six bars, including a tap room with self-serve beer, a full-service kitchen, a cosmic lounge on the fourth floor, private event spaces, and even a putting district. We'll see all of that before the end of the video, but first and foremost, I had to try out the golf. So the first thing you're going to do when you get here is sign in on this terminal. They're going to text you a code. It's going to go to your phone. It's a six-digit code you've got to put in here along with your phone number to activate the bay. After that, you're going to pick an avatar. I chose a weird-looking hockey guy that doesn't look anything like me. And then you've got eight different games to choose from. Here's what the games look like. You've got 21, Bullseye, Longest Drive, Starcast, Warships, Xeno Breach, and just plain old driving range. But you know what? Since we're in Vegas, I think we got to start this off with a little 21. One thing I'm finding out is that the range faces west, so keep that in mind if you come here in the late afternoon or early evening or in the summer. You might be looking right into the sun. Old guy like me's got to warm up a little bit first. All right, we're in Vegas, so the first game we're going to play is called 21. I'm going to set up a hammer over here so you can see the action too. I'm looking at these targets out there and I've got to draw as close to 21 as I can without going over by hitting those targets. I don't see any aces out there, so I guess I'll go for that face card right in the middle. There's a king right in the middle. That's a pretty big target, and that's only like 75 yards away. That should be that should be pretty easy. I sculled it, but that's right in the middle. No probs. All right, king, let's have an ace out there somewhere now. No ace on the board, so I'm gonna hit that, I'm gonna chip for this four right here. If I hit that, then I can go for that seven. Just a little chip. Sit down. Perfect. Seven still on the board, that big red target out in the middle. That thing is huge. Surely I can hit that, right? Oh, that is pure. Right at the flag. Hit the flag. Boom! That's a bullseye, baby. 21. 21. I wish the real game was that easy. Although I did win money in the casino last night playing blackjack. Maybe I should play it this way all the time. All right, as much as this place is about the golf, it's also about the food and drinks. They have a chef curated menu. It looks pretty awesome. I checked it out online before I came in. They also have a tap room over here where you can pour your own beer. They have Cosmic Lounge upstairs. I'm gonna check all that out sooner or later, but first, I'm gonna pull up the menu that's on this QR code right here and uh, see what there is to eat. Atomic Golf is proud of their menu and for good reason. 
The only way this resembles ballpark food is that they swung for the fences with this chef curated menu that includes everything from burgers, salads, and flatbreads all the way down to a luxury menu that includes items like a seafood tower and caviar service. Of course with this being a great group activity there's also shareables like wings, lobster, popcorn, calamari, and more. And let's not forget about the cocktails and beer, there's a huge selection. So you can certainly order anything off the menu to your bay here and uh, eat and drink while you play, but because I'm here by myself, I'm going to wait until after I'm finished with the golf to order some food. However, I did go ahead and get a cocktail. Some of these, well, all of these are Vegas inspired. I got the King inspired by the late, great Elvis Presley, a longtime Vegas performer, of course. This one's got absolute vanilla vodka, screwball peanut butter whiskey, a banana chip, and cream de coco. This is inspired by the fact that the king, Elvis, liked peanut butter and uh, banana sandwiches. That is sweet and delicious. After golf, I hung around to check out the epic sunset at Atomic Golf. It's worth the price of admission. And my biggest regret was that I didn't come looking to eat an entire dinner, although I did get the lobster popcorn and it was absolutely fantastic. If you're a seafood lover like me, you're not going to be disappointed with the lobster popcorn. It was a huge portion of butter poached lobster underneath a bed of seasoned popcorn. It was fantastic. It's on the shareables menu, although I didn't have any trouble finishing it by myself. Tap room and bar is here on the third floor. That's where you're going to find the four your own beer taps using bottom up technology. If you want to just come have a cocktail or some food and a beer, there are plenty of places to sit that don't involve the golf bays. Lots of tables, especially here on the third floor. All of the beers in the tap room here at Atomic Golf are local. They've got Mojave Brewing, that's from Henderson. Love Lady, also from Henderson. Huddle Brewing, that's down in the Arts District. Big Dogs Brewing, that's in North Las Vegas. And then, of course, Abel Baker, that's also in the Arts District here in Las Vegas. All local brews on tap, which is really cool. Tap your card, select your beer, place your cup on the bottoms up pour. Three ounces for $1.75. 16 ounces for $9, 20 ounces for $11. Let's just get a three ounce sampler of this. Fills from the bottom, and there you have it. So the bottoms up technology pours a perfect pint. For some stupid reason, I didn't get a shot of this one filling. It filled it to the top with just a little bit of foam sticking over the top. 16 ounces on the dot, impressive. This is Vanilla Oak by Huddle Brewing here in uh, Las Vegas, and uh, it's really good. I love local brews. This one I've not had before, and uh, I dig it. On the ground floor, you've got your Astrocade, a great place to grab a drink and watch sports on the big screen. As you can see, there are bars on level one, two, and three, and up on the fourth floor is the Cosmic Lounge, right behind that wall. Actually, let me go show you what it looks like inside. Downstairs on the ground floor is the putting district. It uses computer mapping technology so you can putt at virtual holes. Unfortunately, it wasn't being used, so I couldn't show you how it works, although it is a neat feature. One thing I didn't mention earlier, if you're not good at golf, you can't hit a golf ball, well, you could probably fire a golf ball out of a cannon. Yeah, you can play all the same games, only shooting the golf balls out of these cannons instead of hitting them with a golf club yourself. One last note, guys, as much as I regret showing up here right as the sun was beginning to set, I even more regret not showing up now, right at dusk or just after dusk. I mean, this is incredible. Check this out. So that's a little look at Atomic Golf here in Las Vegas, the brand new attraction on the North Strip right next to the Strat. This place has only been open for just over a week now, and it will take time for people to find it. But once they do, once the secret gets out, I think this place is awesome. I have two thoughts from today. The facility is absolutely incredible, and the staff is phenomenal. Shout out to my servers, Trix and Julio. Those guys were awesome, super attentive, and I could tell the entire staff here was super excited about this place and ready to serve. 
Another shout out to Atomic Golf's management. I reached out ahead of time to let them know I was going to be coming. And while this is not a paid promotion, they did wind up comping my entire bill. The bay, the food, the drinks that I had. And I certainly appreciate that. And I think it's important that I let you guys know that I got that as well. So if something kind of like Top Golf has been on your radar, come down here and try out Atomic Golf. I don't think you'll regret it. This place is amazing. It's fun. The prices are reasonable. The menu is incredible. The cocktails were great. And the beer list, again, incredible. Hey, thanks for watching this one, guys. Hopefully you found it informative. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to the channel. It's totally free. And turn on that notification bell so you get notified anytime we upload new content. Thanks, as always, once again for watching, guys. We'll see you in that next video because there's always more for us to show you on Show Me Vegas.